Hello vegan adventurers, welcome to another epic mountain bike adventure in countrysides of eastern Serbia. We got these cycling bags attached to the bicycle so we don't have to carry a heavy backpack. Today we got dropped off in a village Mustapic by Sanja's brother Željko. And the next stop is a village Manastrica. Okay, it's almost 11 o'clock and we're just following this uh, gravel path and it should lead to Kladurovo or some of the villages there. And then we're gonna connect back to Kučevo and in the distance you can see Romanian hills so I think behind the, those hills is already Romania and these are fields so you can see this is all corn and it's not for feeding people it's for feeding animals so actually one third of all the planet soil except of the ice fields is used for either for grazing animals or for growing food for animals so if you want to stop the deforestation and using the land for the animal agriculture you should stop eating meat and also dairy products because it's crazy Okay, it's 11.08 and we are following this road to a village called Monasterica, should be somewhere here. And there's also another path going around the village to Kladurovo, but I think it's too close, so we're just gonna try to go more on the right to some other villages and see how it goes. few options so here we can get to the main road and then uh, continue to uh, another villages or we can go back here and connect to Ranovac and Kladurovo so I think we're gonna go this way okay it's half past 11 and we just got to this crossroad we came from here and I think this is the main road to Petrovac and this is uh, where does this road go This? So this goes back to Požarovac. Okay, so we can go here or we can go back. So we'll see. It's a good one. Alright, so this is the main road. It goes to Petrovac. And we uh, want to do a little loop through Starchevo. And we're hoping it's gonna be a dirt road like this. But it's actually a paved road so um, we can't use our mountain bikes very well this is more for a road bike so we're hoping it's gonna get a uh, dirt road again Hello. so here is a um, European Union invested in these roads and bridges and stuff around these villages so till now we're mostly going on the paved roads but from here starts already the gravel roads which is a good for our mountain bikes. So this road connecting from main road to Starchevo was quite steep and we're barely getting up with the, our 36 cassettes. In the future we want to get at least 40 or 42 cassettes. So those hills over there, that's already the Homode Mountains, Vukan, what else? Ježevac. So and behind that hill is the Petrovac hill. So we plan to go around somehow to these villages and then connect back there to Kučevo. <laughs> Okay, so it's 12 o'clock and we are on top of the hill, so it seems like we're going to go downhill from here and we've got this amazing view, lots of trees here. So 
it's 12.09, we just got to the Starcevo village and it was a little bit paved road it got gravel again and there was a way to the left somewhere but we're not sure which way to go maybe it's here Road. It goes to some other villages and we're gonna keep going this way. There's also a bus station here. There's a price, it's for taxi from here. And it's from Tukuchevo, where we're we going. Where is the Kuchevo? Oh, yeah. 1150. Ooh. So we just came from this paved road and the paved road continues over here to uh, some other villages I don't know the name of and now we're gonna continue with this dirt road to uh, Knežica so it's gonna be a great adventure let's go Okay, so we are 24 kilometers in and we just got this amazing view so I think there's another valley that's connecting the Petrovac which is somewhere down there with the uh, Požarevac and uh, there you have more villages and more landscape but we're gonna continue this road down to uh, Knežavica and then Knežica so this is the crossroad to Ranovac and we're gonna be heading this way to Knežica and then to Petrovac probably as well. Okay, so we are in Petrovac, it's a bigger town and uh, just need to take some water and gonna have lunch somewhere here. Okay, so it's almost 2 o'clock and we're just gonna have lunch in this park in Petrovac. So I'm gonna have these potatoes with spices. Mm. And Sonia has what? Beef salad bread. Mm. Cornbread, hummus, all vegan. Okay, so it's 2.45 and we just finished lunch on those benches there. And now we're gonna continue across this bridge and back into town and then up the hill through Kladorovo back to Kuchevo. So this is Petrovac. Alright, so we just went for a pee. And now we have this uh, road up the hill and then we're gonna see more roads. We got more up the hill, we got a nice view of Homolian Mountains. So these hills in the front of us is uh, Beliki and Mali Vukan. Sanya has been to Mali Vukan, but I haven't been there. And on the left is a hill called Veliki Sumorovac. And this hill on the right, it's called Ježevac, where we plan to go next week, so stay tuned for that adventure. If you go even more on the right, you would get to hill Belanica, which is like 1,400 meters. Left from Veliki Sumorovac, you have hills Vrata and Koblia Glava. Where we've been before, but we want to do more adventures in Homolia Mountains, especially some through hikes and more mountain bike rides as well. Okay, so we just got off the main road from Petrovac. And now we are heading this way back 
and connecting to the main road to Ranovac and then we're gonna connect another road to Kladurovo it's uh, more interesting than going on the main road with a car okay so it's 3.36 and we just got from this road and we're connecting to this road that goes to Ranovac and this is the way that we're going to Knezheva, Knezheva. Okay, so we just came from this road and we're gonna connect to this road. It's still a good road here. Um, so it's not really good for us, it will be good for road bike, but I think it's gonna get worse after. There is a circle. Okay, so we took a wrong road was going around here and now we connected to the road that we wanted to go so now hopefully we can get to Kaona All this area around Kladurovo and other villages is mostly fields and not many forests so that's why we don't go here very often we prefer more foresty areas like Homolian Mountains, even forests near Kaona. And now we got a view of more hills. This is Stube, the highest peak in the Homolian Mountains, almost 1000 meters. And the one on the right side is called Dranj. If you go straight like this, you should get to Kuchevo, but we're gonna follow this road around. Okay, so we are on a crossroad here, we came from this way and there is another wave here that goes back to Ranovac. So we're gonna keep going this way now. So we just got to this main road and I remember we were going here before and we connected down to Kladurovo. Now we came from here. And this road is not actually on maps that me, so we must have made it recently. So we're gonna keep going. We got to this bumpy road. I didn't understand how there are so many rocks on this road. It was really uncomfortable. Okay, so we are on the crossroad to Kaona and Kuchevo and I think straight here is a Mustapich but there's a cows here go vegan, don't harm the animals, yeah? and we came from here so we have a six and a half no, actually 11 more kilometers unless we can cut it through somehow Okay, so we are just on the crossroad now and I think we're gonna keep going here to see if we're gonna connect to the Cerovica and then to Kuchevo because this way we would have to go all the way to Kaona which is another 5 km So we're going up now, trying to get to Cerovica. We are cruising through this road. Okay, so we are at a crossroad. We came from here, and if you keep going up here, you get to Petrovac Hill. And here straight, we go back home. Guys, that's it for this adventure. We are almost back in Kuchevo. 
It was an amazing loop and I think we did over 60 kilometers. Lots of elevation too. As I said, we prefer more thirsty areas, but even this countryside with fields is sometimes nice. Many roads to explore that are not on the maps. It's even more interesting and adventurous to explore new roads. If you would like to join us on adventures like this one, I'm coming up with a website where you can book a retreat in Serbia, other places where we traveled, so stay tuned for that website. And as always, stay healthy and stay adventurous!